Hey guys, welcome back to another video today, and I am back in a new game which is called SCR. This game has recently hit 1 million visits, so go check it out. And you also can go check its its game and uh, there's a group and a discord so if you want to join the discord you can just join their discord and ask any questions within the game they have their own twitter and their youtube channel so if they release any updates they may upload it on their social medias the discord is very active as you know they have lots of members and they also have an ongoing community they also have useful links so then if you want to know when training are or when it occurs you can go check its training session calendar and you can also invite your friends so if you want to play guys don't forget I will also may be bringing it as a series on this game but I am just hoping that everything goes well so guys you can spawn as a passenger and a driver when you start the game. My rank is qualified driver as I attended a training. In the group you'll be able to see all the ranks, some of the ranks you have to do applications for. But to be a dispatcher I don't know but the next rank for me is a dispatcher so I will be of course attending a, attending a dispatcher train. So passengers you can spot on any train line you want. There is two, two, di two different, different train lines. There are the connect and the watch line, and within the those train lines, you can actually spawn at any station you want. So I'm gonna quickly go through the driver, and maybe in part two I will go through the other one. And you also get points which you can't see because uh, it's unfortunately you know cut out, but. That you can get points and experience and uh, within the connect line you always start with the class 357 and then you can oh i can go from stefford central and port benton i played 15 minutes of the game but also the class 707 is an x game the next train to buy which is worth 300 points but if you buy this it will not allow you to go on the water line so what I would tell you that you should you should do is save up a lot of points, or maybe um, or you can just buy Robux, and I will show you why you can spend a lot of Robux in this game, because this game is very good. So guys, I'm gonna start going to a station, and I'll see you very soon. See you then. I just spawn in. You, you spawn with a horn. And the emergency brakes. So if you get a red light, or if you there's a red light in front of you, you have to stop before it, or you will get a violation. You can change your camera. I don't know the key uh, key binds for these, but uh, if you check, it should tell you. You can also look at the map, uh, the connect line, and also the water line. But um, I think they did remove the water line because it was getting confused. You also can see your schedules, and I'm in a new schedule, which I just, uh, there's lots of different schedules, you know, station to station, um, but I will tell you in depth with different trains and, you know, schedules. But my schedule is very easy, but meaning shorter schedules may be longer, and you may get more or less money. So I will meet you guys when I get to Port Benton. And what this game also has is that when you arrive at a station guys, you can see as a passenger when the train arrives and if it's on time, delayed or cancelled. So we are going to, I'm going to Benton but then I will talk to you at the final stop. There will be at times Benton. that the game will have the a signal saying Benton. 80 miles per hour and 100 miles per hour. And don't be scared to push your train to the limit. So when you finish your your r train line, it will bring you to your summary. If you're on time, late, and then it will tell you all your description. So then you can continue your schedule and you can end it. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this game.